afternoon, everybody in South Florida. It's Mike Shue. It's time for my show today. We're going to talk about the 4th of July. And if you are a business person, small business people usually need to be open on those holidays so that they can make money to keep their business going. So the idea is, is that you are going to have a sale on 4th of July or any holiday for that matter. The first thing you need to do is you need to do some planning. So I would say a month before you start Put a small sign up on your door if you're brick and mortar or on your website say we're going to be open on the 4th. And then you have to start thinking about if you're going to do an email blast. Uh, celebrate freedom with products that don't depend on a large budget. So that tells people that you know, you're, you've know you got a lot of discounts going on or it's marked down really well. Independence Day special, you know, and then whatever it is that you're thinking about doing. Last day, independent sale up to 70% off. So not necessarily today but either tomorrow or sunday you would run something like that so you plan all this out you go on the internet you can get a lot of good ideas you can even find emails that have percentage rates for getting open you can work with your you know like we have the hometown news in fort Pierce. you can work with the hometown news and run some type of low budget ad you can you know maybe for every week you know you want to build excitement up to it you show these items are only going to be available this time to this time and this is it's the only time we're doing it uh, we got the orange pill here. You can run ads in that. So buy one, get one free. Works really good. Or I used to say if you buy a sterling silver chain, you would get a, a matching bracelet and a, and a free charm. Or if you spend 100 bucks, you get a free watch. So there's different ideas. Buy one, get one half off. It depends on what your markup is and, and what you've got in your product. If you've got product that there's not a lot of markup, you may only be able to do 10% off. Or maybe 10 15 or 20 percent is pretty much the norm see a lot of 30 percent off usually liquidation is 40 50 60 70 and see 70 percent off very rarely i used to run on my large ticket items i would i would really deep discount um you know stuff that was two grand i would do like 60 percent off and make a little bit of money you're you're, you're not going to get rich but you are getting sales that come into the business you're getting you're restocking your merchandise so we've talked about HubSpot and I wanted to show you uh, an email today that, that I use. So I would like an Independence Day sale, 70% off. You see the BBC, you see the, the HubSpot.com. And what I did is, is HubSpot is integrated into my Outlook. And when I send an email, I can click track email when it opens. And I can also click log this email to HubSpot. So I can go back into HubSpot and I can see if I send it to myself. If I open it once, or if I open it 10 times or open it 25 times. Somebody opens it three or more times, they have an interest, you may generate a phone call. I don't know how you do that in retail sales. If you want to and you got their phone number, what I've been using this in Salesforce, they have this, and I did it for management consulting. And we have people open our, news or, our newsletter 25, 36 times and then call them. They were interested. Go buy, you know, half dozen, half dozen the other, you'd sit down and have a cup of coffee and maybe get into another conversation. But for retail, I don't know that you can pick the phone up and actually call people and you sure don't want to tell them, hey, I saw you opened it 15 times. You never know, they might start to open it and the phone rings. So just give you ideas for 4th of July. Um, we're gonna end here, be safe. Uh, if you want to take a, get a free HubSpot CRM like I have, there's the link to go to and take a look at it. Um, also, win a free bottle of CBD oil at esquaredcbdoil.com. And also check out Small Business Advisor Info. That's for small, small business owners. We're always adding content. I just, uh, writing a second blog, the, the first blog had 30 posts on the, main, on the main site that I have. And so I had to go to Word, WordPress and continue it. And that's in the drop down box. And it tells you that on the site. So be safe out there if you're drinking. Police officers are looking to meet you. Uh, you don't want to be in that situation. Be sure you uh, stay safe. Don't drive and don't text and buckle up. All right, and I'm not your dad. Sorry, I mean to get preachy. You guys have a great a great time today, and thinking of you. Love you. Take care. Bye. Mike Shue signing off.